Hey guys, it's Matthew Davis with Movie Lover here. And next up is my review for Scarface, but before I do that, um I just want uh I just want to dedicate this review to Cra Crash Fan fifteen twelve since this is his new all time favorite movie. It used to be King Kong, but from two thousand five, but now it's Scarface, so I'm gonna review this movie dedicated to him. So Scarface is mainly where you got this man. Uh, played by Al Pacino, his name is Tony, and he has a scar on his face, that's why the movie is basically called Scarface, and mainly he, uh, I couldn't really tell much what the plot was basically about, because I fell asleep a couple times during this movie, but, uh, I will say one thing though, but, um, and that's, uh, this movie was directed by Brian De Palma, who directed Carrie and other films. Um, this film has, it's a very brutal action movie, like, there's a lot of blood and, and disturbing images and graphic and all this other shit going on. So yeah, Tony is a very violent man and, you know, he kills people and all this other shit. Now, my friends, Keenan and Sterling, wanted me to check this movie out since they saw the movies, and they said that it's a great movie. And I agree with them. This is a great movie. I I loved this movie. This movie exceeded my expectations. It was very violent and disturbing, and it had great action and drama. And the acting, the acting is Oh my god, the acting is absolutely perfect in this movie. Al Pacino gives a great performance in this movie. This has got to be his best film since The Godfather, which The Godfather was an awesome movie. I'm not sure if I would call this like a gangster movie, but I will say this. This has everything that I wanted it to be, okay? One of the 80s' best movies. This was even... I'm not sure if I would say this was better than Carrie. I'm not sure. But I will say one thing. I loved this movie. It had everything that I wanted it to be from a brutal um, action film to a downright dramatic film. Alright? If you haven't seen this movie, I recommend it. You know? And of course, you have the line Say hello to my little friend! at the very end of the movie. So, yeah, overall, guys, I give this movie 5 out of 5. It was really that good. Check it out if you haven't seen it. So, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hope you enjoyed it as well, Sterling. And I'll see you guys later. Word out.